And the kid that everyone loves, yes, everyone loves, is back. Kids back, folks. We're back to talk about the second collectible, folks. As I was finishing off the deal. How do you do it? How do you On the blue cookie house, folks. How do I you actually do had it? the phone in my hand. Amazing. And I turned around and I heard a knock on the door, folks. And I thought to myself, so? That's exactly, Gloria. <laughs> I said, Shelf, who could that be? I'm not expecting anyone. I, I said, Gloria, I are you it. expecting anyone? Gloria said, I'm not expecting anyone. Yeah, my bra burning sister. Your bra burning sister. <laughs> continue, continue. And I thought to myself, who could that be, folks? So I went to the door, I opened it up, and you know who it was, folks? You're not going to believe it, folks. It was Zanesville, Ohio, folks. Yes, Zanesville, Ohio was knocking at the door. And they had a gift for the kid, folks. And we did it again. Just when we thought it was over, it's never over, folks. Zanesville loves the kids. Never forget that. What number Cheers. is it? Can we give a hint? What number is it? No. No hint? No. Okay, folks, real quick. When I actually landed this item, it was actually 11.30 at night. I was in a state of shock. I couldn't believe it. When I actually acquired this item, I actually ran out onto the terrace and was actually doing the two-step and uh, Gloria was looking at me while she was having her deal back and she thought I'd lost my mind. You know what it's like guys to see a 185 pound little muscle dude dancing a jig in the terrace at night? Was, was, was crazy! Was crazy! So, uh, <laughs> without further ado folks, I'm going to unveil the item and then I'm going to discuss a little bit about the item. Good. Okay folks, here we go! Awesome. The kid! What is the thing, Phil? He pulled another rabbit out of the house, folks. Here we go. Here we go, folks. Hustle up, hustle down. Goodness, I got this. McCoy, Red, Leprechaun, folks. Not the working jar. Here we go. Unmarked. We can set up a working jar. Folks, <laughs> when the, folks, when the door knocked and I answered it, it was the Red Leprechaun. I said, no. Red Leprechaun, no more room. <laughs> There's no more room here for you guys. Poor Gloria has been delegated to a small corner in the apartment. And you know what the leprechaun said to me, folks? The leprechaun said, the reason why the kid, they said, listen up, kid. The reason why we're running for the border is because we're afraid Clinton's going to get into office. And I said to my friend, the little red leprechaun, little red leprechaun, don't be afraid. Because as long as Trump's around, Trump is going to stop Clinton with the bundle. And if, even if it doesn't work out and Trump doesn't get into office, we can always rely on the boy in Georgia. And what's his motto, folks? Thumbs up, thumbs up. Shout out to the big boy. Shout out to the big boy in Georgia. We're going to do it. Okay, folks, that's it for our collectible show this week. Join us back. For sure, I'll have something next week, folks. Okay, what does that make? What, on the final note, how many le leprechauns do you have? 17 leprechauns, oh folks! My God. 17 and counting! We okay, have a folks. little army! I have to finish my We stuff. have a little army! Oh my God, folks, there's no more room! <laughs> leprechauns, do not cross the border, please! Okay, folks, join us back! Bye-bye! Cheers! We take